Welcome everyone, Adam the Woo here, coming to you from Belleville, Illinois, at a place called National Shrine of Our Lady of the Snows. Don't be confused, there is no snow, but this is called the National Shrine of the Lady of the Snow. It's my second channel, Daily Blog channel. Look at that right there. That is an impressive, awesome amphitheater out here on this massive religious complex. Very cool, but one thing I really wanted to show you Outside St. Louis, Missouri, across the line into Illinois, lies this particular item right here. That's right. It's a prayer antenna. Do you ever pray? Do you pray to God or do you pray to someone else? Whoever you pray to, do you always think that maybe you need something to, in a heighten, to heighten, and progress quickly your prayers a little faster than just them coming out of your heart or your head or your mind. Well, obviously, they've solved the problem here. And here we have a prayer antenna. Look at this. It's a prayer antenna. I don't think I can safely say I've never seen or heard of anything like this. Who am I to even know if this would even work? But well, why wouldn't it work? It kind of makes sense. It kind of doesn't make sense. I'm kind of on the fence on whether it makes fence or it, it doesn't make fence, sense. Make fence? Man, it's early. It doesn't make sense or it does make sense. On the fence, off the fence. I can't communicate correctly, but there's a fence. Look, that's a fence. That's what confused me. This is called the Millennium Spire and Candelabrum. Now look at the size of this. So basically I'm guessing you come out here, you can meditate down there or all the other facilities at this impressive complex. Very cool, very serene. Lots of monuments, lots of areas where you can sit and think and pray. But really, I guess if you were going to pray out here, the best place to pray, if you wanted to get your thoughts up into the heavens, would be right here under this antenna. They've actually provided some little candles here. You can see how people have lit the candles. This is a prayer candle. The Millennium Spire. Book of Remembrance. Book, can't even talk. I cannot talk. It's so early, I just woke up. Book of Remembrance. This book of remembrance contains the names of benefactors who have generously given their support for the Millennium Spire and Candelabrium. Please remember these memorialized in your prayers. Those memorialized in your prayers. Oh, wow, look at this. Here's all the names of people that have donated and given to help this Millennium Spire, this prayer antenna come about. That's actually really cool. Very interesting. There's some candles lit back there. Look at this up here. There are hundreds of candles behind this curtain. Behind that curtain are lots of empty candles. Only a few that are lit. A lot of them lit here. I think this is very interesting. This is a very interesting area. I really wish I had more time to walk around. It's a whole massive complex. I don't know how many acres there are. But like I was saying, there's a huge amphitheater over there. There's some figurines of some life-size angels right over there. And way down over the hill, there's a little meditating garden. All kind of cool stuff out here. So there you have it, everyone. Something very interesting. What are your thoughts on this? What do you think about this prayer antenna? Very interesting. There you have it. Look at that. The prayer antenna protruding up from my palm at the moment, or my head. So the antenna, if you had a prayer, 
would come out of the top of your head straight up. The way I can formulate and figure it out, I might be incorrect, is maybe you, in your heart and in your mind, you have a thought or a prayer that you want the heavens, the Lord, God, whoever you pray to, to hear. You would go over there, light a candle, your prayer would go underneath the candle, and then formulate up into the heavens. Look how beautiful the sky looks today. Awesome. Hope I'm not incorrect in my assumption. What do you guys think about this? I think it's very interesting. What are your thoughts on this particular vlog and this particular subject? Right here. The antenna of prayers. I gotta get a default picture. The antenna, the antenna of prayers right here. All right, everybody. Thanks for watching this. Check down below for my t-shirts. Today I'm gonna be in Indianapolis, Indiana, going from Illinois, from St. Louis, Missouri, through where I am now, into Indiana, playing a show tonight. And then after that, I don't know where I'm gonna be. Check the Guttermouth Facebook page. Facebook backslash Guttermouth or just Google Guttermouth on Facebook. You can see where I'm playing. So we're getting ready to hit the road, getting ready to go pick up the guys in the band van. But I wanted to show you this first. So check down below for my t-shirts. Like I was saying, you can get any t-shirt, any size, any color. You can formulate your own colors and sizes. Just pick a design that's on the website, adamthewoo.spreadshirt.com. And remember, I'm going to see you tomorrow, but only if you subscribe up here and up here. Have a great day. Goodbye.